Ince with the challenge. Here's Hughes. Cantona. We might have thrown it through quickly into the path of Hughes. Kilkline couldn't cut it out. Here's Roy Keane. And that's number one. It's taken just 12 minutes to arrive. A bit of a slip by Kilkline. Cantona's pass found a way through to Hughes. And Keane had the space to bury his first goal for nine games, his eighth of the season. Taylor strong enough to see off Hughes, who's uh, a little altercation with some supporters there. He's very angry about something, Mark Hughes. In fact, he's holding his face. Now, it's stating the obvious to say that it's inadvisable to engage in an argument with fans, but having said that, he was clearly provoked. A little bit of space for Frank McAvenny. Away from Parker. Not from Bruce, though. Nighthold with a shot, took a deflection, he did! With Nighthold has equalised to Swindon Town. And bottom of the table they may be, but they are made of stern stuff. Luke Nyholt's first goal in English football, set up initially by Frank McAvenny. Steve Bridge got a good chance in on him, but Roy Keane on the edge of the penalty area just dangled a foot of the ball and diverted it beyond Peter Schmeichel. <laughs> McClare in towards Hughes. Oh, he had a side of goal there. Just still half a yard on Kilcline. Monko with a free kick. Headed by Pallister, came off Kilcline. Fjortov couldn't get to it, in sort of that. Monko. Oh, lovely run. John Monko. Oh, has got the finish it deserved. Nice from Giggs. McClare. Ince. Giggs again. Found its way to Keane. But Warlock uh, stood his ground well. Irwin. Came off some of it. McClare trying to make something of it. Ince. Oh! Beautifully struck. Beautiful goal. Paul Ince puts Manchester United back in front. Clean as a whistle. Insta Giggs. Hughes. This is Taylor. Captain's example. He's running away from the ball. Steve Bruce, the other skipper, had to reply. Really has been an inspiration to Swindon. Got a priceless goal for them in the uh, playoff final at Wembley. It's towards Kilcline. So Michael not only took it with consummate ease, but had set Manchester United going forward in the blink of an eye. Cantona tackled though by Monka. Didn't like it, got it back. Oh, now the referee was very, very close to that. Monka lies on the ground. Cantona under the microscope again. There's a card coming out. It's red. And Cantona goes out of the match. And as it happens, out of the big showdown at Blackburn in a fortnight's time. There was a time early last season where Manchester United made quite public the fact that they didn't particularly want Brian Hill refereeing any more of their games. This is the first time he's taken charge of them since. Taylor. In towards Scott, Michael comes, makes a punch, chance for Whitbread, chance for Scott, chance for Sanchez, chance for Keeps his run going. 
Hughes down towards Giggs. Digby with his head. It's in though. Brought down by Kilcline. Good advantage. Giggs. McClare! He had Ince behind him. And Ince is letting him know about it. He was better position. Irwin got a foot to it. This is Ling. This is Scott. Fjotov in pursuit. It's come for Sanchez. Charged down by Pallister. That's it. It wasn't the most attractive football match that these two sides have been involved in this season. But there were plenty of talking points. All that will be overshadowed by the dismissal of Eric Cantona after 20 minutes of the second half. The final scoreline will really play only a bit part in that story. It's Swindon Town 2, Manchester United 2. Well, now we know.